Well, we're less than two weeks away from the 4th of July, and just as we're paying more for just about everything these days, now you can add fireworks to that list. Our Brent Solomon is here with how fireworks customers are getting less bang for their buck. You're right about it, Mike. A reminder, it is against the law, by the way, to possess or light fireworks in St. Louis unless you have a permit. Outside of the city limits, different localities have different rules. In places where you can buy and use them, some customers may be in for a bit of a surprise. An empty tent and tons of boxes to be unloaded. So why not keep it all in the family? The stink bombs. I love these. I'm glad we got those this year. You're looking at the Barnetts. They've operated the President Fireworks Stand in St. Charles for 19 years now. Mom keeps everyone in line. You can't sell anything with a stick, a missile, a wing, uh, anything that goes up in the air and the, the stuff comes back down in people's yards. And since the rules fluctuate, depending on the locality, it's up to local businesses to know what can fly. A lot of injuries are caused by bottle rockets. We do have a sign that, up that, that yeah. says when you can legally shoot in the city. On top of that, customers will be greeted with something else, the potential of sticker shock. That's because local businesses are paying more. Uh, last year they went up 40%, this year they went up another 25%. So if you want it, you'll have to pay. Mom says you can thank the suppliers for that. The freight is so high. Um, two years ago they paid maybe $5,000 to bring a container into the United States. This year it was 30000 but that didn't stop customers last year. Yeah. So we literally sold out like on the 3rd of July last year. Yeah, that's unheard of. And because business requires you to thrive, they're braving the heat to get the stand up and running. We're yeah. selling fun. Just as long as the boys can keep that in mind. 17, 18 pages of rules to a fireworks stand. Everything will be A-OK. -okay. That way we get to stay open every year. And come back. <laughs> All right. The Department of Public Safety recommends going to a public fireworks display. But if you're going to do them at home and if it's legal to do so, the department says only light fireworks one at a time. Also, have a garden hose or a bucket of water nearby just in case of a fire. And again, a reminder, fireworks are illegal to buy and set off in St. Louis City and County. St. Charles County allows them between the hours of 10 a.m. and 11 p.m. from July 2nd to July 5th. They're also allowed in Jefferson County, but some local cities have different rules.